hopeful though finally have answers as to where Amanda Dean is. The Huron County Sheriff says she was found at a safe house, but five and a half years later, they've reopened her case. I'm hoping she's alive. Amanda Dean's sister Shannon has never given up hope that one day she'll come home. It's been five and a half years since the mother of four was last heard from. Her son Josh, who was a teen the last time he saw his mom, is glad her case is being reopened. It's amazing, really. Uh, it's, it's really good hearing that, you know, someone's finally taking action. Within 24 hours of her disappearance, the Huron County Sheriff said Amanda was found at a safe house. Her family says it's out of character. They haven't heard from her since she was apparently found. Police reports show Amanda was in an abusive relationship around the time she went missing. Do you believe Amanda was found in a safe house the day after she went missing? Absolutely not. I don't believe that one bit. Shannon says Amanda was trying to move out of the house in Collins where she lived with her boyfriend. She says her sister often called her, saying the abuse was getting worse. And I think maybe that's what struck the last time we seen her. Maybe, I'm just saying, he got mad that she was gonna leave. The Huron County Sheriff tells us they've officially reopened an investigation into Amanda's whereabouts. They say Miss Dean entered into a safe house in 2017 and has not had contact with her family since. So will Amanda's family find out if she really was found five and a half years ago? Her mother hopes her family will get the answers they deserve. He needs to tell me why he can go out there and say she's safe, she's an adult. If she wants to contact her family, she will, when he's never even laid eyes on her or heard her voice. The BCI will be leading this investigation. If you have any information about where Amanda Dean is, you can contact them.